Hello everybody and welcome back to Scrubby Carry Survival Base Gnule! Welcome back guys to another crazy creation episode. Uh, today I've got another stupid thing up my sleeve. It's either gonna go really good or really bad. <laughs> so if you're excited for today's episode, please smash like. Thank you. So in the last episode, we built ourselves a submarine and I didn't get it completely 100% finished because I basically didn't have another thruster. What I, what I kind of do is instead of using the buttons to go up and down and, and waste fuel with thrusters, I need another thruster point in downwards um, so we can actually descend like that. But to do this, we need component kits and a lot of them. And I'm sick and tired of smashing bots and shooting them with spud guns. So I thought what we'd do today is try and build a vehicle that can smash bots. Now... I'm going to put everything on the line in this video. We are going to get rid of our spud shotguns. They are going in a chest for today. We are going to go out on Big Bertha and try and take on the boss guys, the, the big red dudes, with a vehicle. And we're going to see if we can create a vehicle that can kill the bosses. Because if I can kill them, then they drop component kits. And then I don't have to go around and farming. I could just basically build a vehicle that can smash it. Now... You know, in the last episode, we had a lot of comments like, Oh, Squid, Big Bertha isn't big anymore. It's not the same. Squid, what have you done? So, I made her a little bit bigger. Look, she's, she's, she's a little bit more chonky. She moves a little bit better. She doesn't turn that well because, as you can see, I have got myself a bearing on the front. Because I was... Oh, my God, look at wheeling. Woo! I've got a wheeling vehicle. <laughs> the talk is crazy. Um, but yeah, so the reason why it's not driving that well is because uh, this 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 thing here just being messing around with some design. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna basically have an arm on the front that comes down and then squishes them because I found out with my base that squishing things are the way to go with bots. Also, I've made a few upgrades on my little thingy here, my little farm. So. I've made some sensors, but again, I needed to save my component kits for Big Bertha. So I haven't had a chance to really do a look at the state of this. It got wrecked one night. It got proper wrecked, but I've done it on three sides so far, and it works absolutely perfectly now. Watch this. Look, I'm a bot. Ah, uh, crops. <laughs> it's so good. It works amazing. And <laughs> leh. But anyway. Um, yeah, so I really need to work on Big Bertha today to sort her crushingness out. So what we're going to need is at least two pistons, maybe four. So let's get cracking with them. And then we need to work on the design, make her look all pretty and beautiful. And hopefully the weight should sort itself out. I could do with putting some suspension on the front as well. So we may actually upgrade her for that. But yeah, let's make the squishy squish. Um components which is literally making ourselves some more pistons let's get one on the go and then we're just waiting for another one of these blocks should be in this chest there we go pop them back in and let's make another piston so that's two so we're gonna have to do some testers with some whip bots and some hair bots to see how two kind of you know how, how powerful it is uh, I'm gonna upgrade, upgrade them to the max amount but if we don't need more than two there's no point wasting any more like component kits and stuff like that so yeah, now we need to work on the arm. So all I'm thinking is basically it's just some a controller that brings these uh, forward. And uh, yeah, just some pistons that press and squish things. That's pretty much it. We don't even need um, a really high-tech controller for this, to be honest. So I don't know if I've got any lying around. Probably not, knowing me. Also, I've built it out with this stuff because it looks cool, but it's probably too heavy. But I don't really care. Do we? Oh, we took this one as well, didn't we? Why? What? 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 How much is a controller? I need more stuff. All right, so piston one check, piston two check. Uh, bearings I need, and we will take the glue. So I need to I need the controller first. Also I found another legendary or an epic in uh, a little loot box. So we can see how much cotton this takes. I think it's twenty five or something. Is it twenty? How much cotton do I have? Wait, have I got any fuel on this guy? Come on, Bert, we need cotton. <laughs> it's just an excuse for me to actually just go on, Bert. <laughs> I believe there's a butt ton of cotton this way. Oh, look, there's like a tr There's a, a thing you do. Look, 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 look. There's like an, uh, the, whatever, the cage farm is there. That's pretty interesting. I basically sent an email to Scrap Mechanics saying that we need to have component kits and like bearings and stuff. 
um, actually back into the trader shop because what the heck's happening here? Floating cotton. <laughs> yeah, we need to have them back into the trader shop because once you get the guns, uh, the trader shop, basically, Larry becomes useless. So, I don't want to tell that. I don't want to say it to him because, you know, we've got to make him feel special every now and then. But, yeah, they need to start adding more stuff in so people get more of an incentive to, to keep farming. Apparently, during, like, the week one launch of the game, you could buy five component kits for two of these trade, uh, two of these uh, caged farmers, which is insane. I wouldn't even be complaining. Like, you know, could rock up, find these dudes... Sell them for component kits. Oh, 10 component kits for four of them, 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 them guys. That would have been amazing. I'm kind of angry at myself that I didn't, that I didn't really see how important component kits were at the time and just wake up and be like, you know, Squid, you need to, you need to harvest the, the crap out of these component kits. But if today's video works, then we won't really need to worry about them because we can go to one of the boss farms, uh, the, the warehouse, the abandoned uh, cities. Oh, I've heard there's another boss tile out there, which is kind of like, um, burnt sort of ember sort of place. <laughs> Good description. But apparently, yeah, if we go there, they drop three components, so that's the goal for today. Anyway, let's, uh, let's make this while we wait. Please say it's not a glove. I'm hoping that it's not a freaking glove. If it's a glove, I'm going to be so angry. I've had way too many gloves. Do you know what? I'm not looking forward to this. <laughs> I'm supposed to look forward to it, but I'm not. Oh, is that a... What is that? Is that a... Is that a bin bag for our head? Finally got ourselves a helmet. What is that? <laughs> what is that, Scrap Mechanic? What is What is <laughs> Yeah, sure, why not? Let's go for it. We got ourselves a bin bag. Nice. Apparently all the mechanics are wearing it nowadays. It's all the fashion. Anyway, let's crack on through the night. So I'm not sure if this is going to be wide enough for the big dudes. Ah, I kind of need something wider, don't I? I'm going to have to kind of work on the shape. The thing is, I don't really want it to be too wide. But I guess I guess we could come out maybe two more and see how that is. So let's, let's just do this. Let's just bring it here. And then another two wide. I've run out of blocks. No. Okay, we'll get rid of the fancy. I say fancy. We'll get rid of the crappy design for now. <laughs> okay, so that goes to there. So this needs to come back to there. That looks perfect. And now we basically need to tell the controller to flick it back 90 degrees when we press the switch. We made a switch in here. And uh, now the most annoying thing that we're going to have to do is really work on the piston. So... It's going to be slow, and we need to work on the range. We're definitely going to need some more component kits, which is super annoying. But let's just work on, you know, the sweet spot for the range. So let's go... Okay, so does this work? Uh, nope. <laughs> that needs turning. That's cool. It drives pretty well. What I might do is I might actually have it tuck into these parts. So... If we switch the controller to make it go to minus 180 on both sides, and then it might sit a little bit flusher. And then what I can do is I can build something here for it to sit on. There we go. And then sh that shouldn't connect back into it because obviously we haven't we haven't really connected it. It should just be resting on it, and then that way it's going to be a lot better when we drive in. <laughs> Look at the paper bag on my head. <laughs> I can't. Uh, and then. Yeah, when we want to crush, we just kind of... Look at the flex on the wheels. Holy crap. <laughs> These wheels are a little bit hectic now. I'm not going to lie. It, like, keeps going even when I've, I've stopped. I don't know if this is going to be wide enough for the big dudes. Oh, we need to measure them somehow. Okay, switch acquired. We'll put this next to it. And then we'll do... Bada boom. Bada bing. Bada ba. Nice. Nice bit of crushing action going on. We might have to strengthen, because look at the flex. Is there a halfway point? Six is perfect. Okay, let's upgrade this. Let's put it faster. Let's upgrade this. Let's put it faster. How many do we have left? This is two. Upgrade again. And upgrade you again. So, this should be pretty quick, actually. Oh, yes. 
It's odd because I've put the pistons in the wrong place. That is annoying. <laughs> okay, I need to fix this. Okay, this is what we're working with. And then we got a... Uh... Okay, that's not that's not on properly. Well, one second. So, connect that to that. And then we got squishy, squishy. Oh, we need to extend it by one more. Okay, yeah, it's because I, um, I moved it back a little bit. So we could kill the bosses. What's going on here? We, is this one lower? Okay, we can't be having this. We need symmetry in our builds. If, if, if it's anything in Scrap Mechanics, I'm known for having the most perfect build. So we gotta, we got to keep up to that. All right, well, I think it's about time we went and did a little bit of a test. So let's, let's, let's yeah, let's do it. <laughs> um, I guess the best place to start would be in the cornfields because the little hairbots love to come out and uh, terrorize the poor moo cows. So we're gonna go over there and teach them a lesson or two. And look at that. Let's get, let's get, let's get prepared. Oh no, just squish myself. <laughs> it's number two. Okay, here we go. Here's a hairbot. We've got ourselves a little tricky hairbot here. Okay, I did that. It knocked him over. Okay, why did he not die? Oh, he did! <laughs> oh, that worked perfectly. I don't know why he didn't die the first time. Uh, hang on, here we go. He doesn't even, like, register on here. That is amazing. It just crushes them instantly. Hang on, hang on. Oh, yeah, we knock him down and then... Oh, maybe it needs to be more powerful. <laughs> maybe it doesn't. And then we just literally just drive over it. Why is this? I never ever build things this quickly and they go so well. This is not normally what happens on this channel. I'm a little bit shocked, to be honest. Uh, now, I don't know if this is going to be wide enough for the bots. I need to go and measure them, but look at the state of this. I wonder if we could pick cows up like this. Hold on. I wonder why it's not crushing them instantly. That's quite interesting. Maybe if we do it so it's eight on each side, so it, like, pushes past them. There we go. That's going to be a little bit more effective. Okay. We need more hair bots. I never thought I'd say that, but we need more hair bots. There's going to be some around here. Okay, there's one terrorizing a poor cow, like I imagined. Stop! Hey! Come here! Come here! Come here! Oh, we just missed him. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, he's knocked over. Wait for him to get back up. Hey, sweetie, like, works. It doesn't work. I cannot be that accurate, because... Okay, there we go. I mean, it definitely works. It definitely works. This thing is ridiculous. I kind of need to iron out the bugs. I wonder if we add maybe two more pistons, maybe it'll flex less and it'll be more powerful. But I don't think I have any, um, yeah, anything else to, to uh, any of the component kits to actually make the pistons. This guy's coming for me. Come on, then. He just fell over in some corn. What is you used to be so roof ruthless, but now look at you. <laughs> I think as well, I need to put like a plate stopping them. So they actually stick instead of running past, if that makes sense. So what I'm saying is, if we can get into this area here, is I need to put something... I need to put like a plate. There we go. That's what I'm, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. That's what they need to stop. Obviously, I can build it out a little bit more. Let's do that quickly. Guys, this is a success. So what I'm going to do now is I really need to go and uh, measure the bosses. I wish we could make more pistons, actually, though. I think we're going to need more pistons to kill the bosses. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm not sure if she's ready or not, but um, I think I've been playing around with some stuff, and I think I'm quite confident. Now, I don't know what's ha gonna happen if the big red dudes are too big. I'm probably gonna have to run away. I haven't really thought of a plan B. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but let me give you a tour, so we can, of course, crush. Now we can slam into the ground with two pistons. Crush, slam, crush, slam. If we could do that. It looks like a face at the front. We can pull these up. I haven't actually managed to put the 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 top on uh, a bearing just because I couldn't really be bothered. But let's go do one more test on the hairbots before we go over to see the big dudes. Now, I'm kind of worried that this front bit especially uh, is going to be too small to fit over the big dude's head. But I don't know. As I say, I'm probably going to leave it outside and I'm going to run in and, and measure him first. But yeah, I want to see what happens when we crush it. So let's, uh, we need to find ourselves a hair bot. Here's one over here. 
Come on, lads. They're just doing some uh, farming methods here. Oh, God. Hey, stay away from my vehicle, please. You ready for this? You ready for this? Huh. Oh! Okay, no, don't go around the side. Don't. Okay, we just, we just like literally ran him over and he's dead. <laughs> okay, we got another one coming in. We got another one coming. Ready? Oh no, we missed. Okay, apparently if we just run into them, they just die. That's interesting. <laughs> We've made a vehicle. Oh my goodness, did he actually destroy some blocks? I think he did, you know. Can we like flatten a cow as well? Let's try. <laughs> uh, no. The cow is indestructible. No, apparently not. Apparently if I just run into the bots, they just die with this thing anyway. It's that heavy. But yeah, I'm not 100% sure this is gonna work, but you know what? It's been good fun making it. So let's go and uh, let's go test it out. I still think it's not gonna be wide enough, but hey, whatever. It's, we can have a laugh. So I'm gonna get us some food and then we're gonna be on our merry little way. I just keep saying to myself, well, if anything happens, at least, you know, it's not gonna be as bad as when Bert flew off because they took, that was like a hundred uh, component kits gone down the drain. So I'm not too salty if this goes. I'll be a little bit salty, but not too salty. Okay, so we got ourselves some beets, some carrots. Um, I kind of want some other stuff. Pineapples, let's take some pineapples. Let's put all the rest of this crap away. As I said, there's gonna be no spud guns taken today. Just my vehicle and that's it. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Do you know what? Just for a little bit of added protection, we're gonna put some of these. These are super durable. We'll put a few of these on her. Where's she gone? She's over here. <laughs> there we go. That's about all I can fit on. <laughs> oh yeah, this is the, the cheapest vehicle I've ever made. There we go! Brilliant! Okay, let's set off. I've got food. The times are wasting. I have got blocks if I need to make uh, it bigger or wider or anything like that. So don't worry. Your pretty little faces. Oh yeah, I do really wish that I put the front on more of a, like a bearing. Just to make it look neater. But look at Big Bertha. She has upgraded. She is big now. She's an absolute tank. And uh, I really like it actually. Now I think there's a boss by I'm like all the way over this way. So I've got to travel for a little bit. So I'll catch up with you guys when, uh, yeah, we, we're pretty much there. Uh, what's happening to my vehicle? Oh God. <laughs> oh no. No, what's he doing? <laughs> Bertha. Oh God, I need to catch it. 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 Catch it, squid. Where's it gone? Oh, oh no. No, 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 not again. I'm having flashbacks to Bert. Are you good? <laughs> what is he with me in dodgy vehicles? Oh, I can't take much more of these wheels. So the bearing wheels have, they're a little bit glitchy sometimes, apparently. Okay, where is this scrap city? I swear it was round here somewhere. Really need to protect the wheels. There was a hairbot then that just nearly like hit my wheels on my car. So I, I, I think I, before it becomes nighttime, I really need to protect the wheels. Like if anything from original Big Bertha, I need, that's what it's taught me. So yeah, we need to just do this quickly. I've only got this metal though. There must be a scrap city around here. Wait, is that it? Are we here? <gasps> Guys. We have arrived at the Scrap City! Oh, I'm nervous. I'm super nervous now. If this works, we don't have to worry about any more stupid components. <laughs> okay, 10? 12, maybe? What's this one on? 10. Okay, put you on 10. 10 will be enough, and then we need you super fast. Super fast. Okay, let's try this. Yes! Okay, I'm ready! I'm not! <laughs> okay, we're gonna go for it. Oh, God. Oh, there's one right here. There is one right here. Okay, you need to go away. This is my big moment. Just get crushed. Okay, I'm gonna ram him! We're gonna ram straight into him. We're gonna ram straight into him, guys. Here we go, 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 here we go. Crush him! Crush him! Come on!
Okay, okay. I need I can do this, 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 I can do this. I can do this. I just need to get rid of the hair bots. It's chasing after me quite fast. We knocked him over though. We proper knocked him over. Okay, we're gonna do this again and get some good speed, I reckon. Here we go, 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 here we go. Come on! Oh, we need to get up. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Turn, squid, turn, 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 turn. Okay, there's two. I'm not ready for two. I ain't even taken a one yet. Okay. We need to knock him and then squash him. But the thing is, I need to kind of get in position a little bit better. This would be a lot better with four-wheel steering, but I guess it's the compromise with the uh, fuel efficiency. I need to work on, like, how I can easily kill him. I think knock him over and then squishing him seems like the best option. Okay, let's try it, 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 let's try it. So we need to knock him over. And then we need to squish him. I'm, like, throwing him about like he's nothing. Swing! No! No! Oh, my wheels! Oh. <laughs> Ow! Wait, what? Oh, no, guys. No! It wait! We, we knocked him over! Okay, buddy. Maybe spud guns are the way to go. That sucks. That sucks. How am I going to get back? Oh, my wheel. My wheel. Okay, I need to get him out of there and, and see the damage. Oh, no. My wheel. <laughs> well, these great crushing hair bots, just not the big dudes. Oh, no. Where am I going to get a wheel from? So you can't let him swing. If you let him swing, he will destroy anything. Okay, there's another part of my vehicle here. I think this is my other arm. I had so I had protection on that side as well. No, no, no wheel. That sucks, man. That absolutely sucks. <laughs> well, we can easily knock them over. Maybe I just need to make like a big truck just to sit on them. Oh, no. That sucks. Big Bertha, what did they do to you? Big Bertha's like, you did this, Squid, with your stupid ideas. Uh, where does this go now? At least it didn't destroy... Oh, it destroyed a bearing. I don't have another bearing either. Ah, we've only got this crushy crush left, and I've got no wheels. What am I going to do? Where are we going to get a wheel from? Do we even get... I haven't even seen a wheel in, like, a box or a crate. Is there any way we could turn this into a three-wheeler three -wheeler to get back home? We might have to turn this into a three-wheeler to get back. If I can if I can salvage this, this would be a miracle. Okay, I'm gonna have to do some work, guys, to see if we can get this back so we can at least get home, but I don't know how. I'll have to try and figure something out. Oh, Big Bertha, I'm sorry. Maybe we should stick to hair bots, but I feel like this concept should be able to work. Like, we did crush him, but... Maybe we just need to, like, crush him more? <laughs> I've just seen his destroy the seat, hasn't he? Oh, my goodness. How are we going to get back? Oh, please say there's a seat in here. Please, there's got to be a seat. There's got to be one seat in all this building. Okay, I've got food. I can do this. This can be, this can be a decent finish to the episode. If we can... Well, I mean, it won't be a decent finish because we kind of failed, but... At least we we made a vehicle that we could destroy bots, but I, I need a level I need a level two. I need a level two chest with a seat. A level two chest, please be a seat. Come on. A freaking radio. Squid, I need a seat. Game. He has a radio. <laughs> Thank you, game. Feel like that's a level two chest. Level 2 chest. Please be a seat. Come on. Please. Please. <laughs> Big 
off-road suspension. Come on, please be another level two chest up here. Please. Please, I'm begging. I'm desperate. I'm a desperate man right now. Well, I think I'm a little bit stuck here. <laughs> I feel like I've looted all the level 2 buildings. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I'm a big massive idiot. Well, if anything that can come of this, I can officially say that I made a, a bot smashing vehicle. Just not... Oh, is that level 2 chest? I was going to say, just not the boss one. Like, the boss ones are crazy. I don't know if, you, if it's possible. You can mow them down easy enough. It's a level 1. You can mow them down easy enough. But, you just can't flatten them with the vehicle. Or maybe you can, but, you know, mine was a pretty crazy vehicle. Oh god, no. No, 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 I, no, 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 buttons, buttons are not my friend. <laughs> turn it off, 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 turn it off. No! Oh my goodness, thank god for the tree. Oh, this sucks! I think this is literally how I'm going to get out of here. Or maybe not. <laughs> well, she moves, but I have no steering. And I can't even look at you guys. <laughs> I miss the seats. So there should be an office chair. I'm, I'm, I'm really running out of ideas here. But there should be an office chair at the warehouse. Okay, this is my last stop. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Come on, Squid. You can do this. You can do this. You can do this. You can do this. Tip box ain't got nothing on you. Oh, did I steal this? I think I stole this off his chair. Previous Squid, why? Is there a switch anywhere? No switch. I got the chair. Okay, I need one switch. And this dude's camping it. And I don't know if it's here or not. I can see something. It's going to be a seat and a light. I know it is. Please be a switch. That's a light. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Is that a seat? It's a seat. Where's all the switches gone? Oh no. No! <laughs> this is how you get a mission done properly. If you bring out the big guns. It's a little bit heavier. With the bed on, I'm not gonna lie, but we need it. Bert, stop freaking out, please. Bert. I don't want to get off him. But I need to reset him. Why is everything going wrong? Bert, Bert, chill. God's sake, Bert. <laughs> okay, I need my bag. Need my bag! Cool, got all my stuff. Alright, let's get back. Uh, get Big Bertha back. She should be over here, somewhere, somewhere over here. There she is, Big Bertha. So I'm not one to kind of stop. Uh, so this is what I'm gonna do. All right, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna fully yeet this guy. So, I want to end the video on a good note. We've got our last stuff back. Um, I don't really want any of this junk. I kind of want to rebuild uh, for the next episode and try again. But, you know what? I don't want, you know, them guys to have shown me up in this video. So, even if they destroy what I've, what I've got here, I just want to knock him over one last time. There he is. My nemesis. Come on then, bro. Okay, oh god. Oh god. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming out of his hole. He's coming out of his hole. Okay, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. This is how we end the video. Ah! Come on! Bring it! Yeah! Oh, oh god. No! Oh. I'm sorry! Done! Leave my vehicle! Ah, oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, stop! What if we could do this? Got a plan! Plan number two! I don't know when to quit. That's my problem. Ready, watch this! 
Nothing happened! <laughs> ah! Always the seat. Always the freaking seat. Well, guys, that has been my bot smashing uh, yeah, attempt. Hopefully, I haven't tried smash like if we did. I don't want to give up here. I feel like this is a feasible thing, but I just don't know which way to go about it. So, um, yeah, it looks like we can successfully destroy here, bots. Um, it seems like I'm going to have to rethink my plans for the big red dudes. But, uh, yeah, hopefully I've enjoyed, and I'll see you tomorrow for another Scrap Academy video.